Michelin is working with General Motors on an airless tyre called the Unique Puncher Proof Tyre System, or UPTUS for short. Airless tyres, which go by various names, such as non-pneumatic tyres or flat-free tyres, are not supported by air pressure, but rather a rib suspension system, sort of like rubber spokes. The outer tyre still has a traditional tread pattern you will find on any road tyre. But instead of rubber side walls, these tyres have a see-through rib pattern that not only suspend the wheel from hitting the ground, but also act as mini shock absorbers. And because these tyres are not filled with air, they are not susceptible to punctures from either debris on the roads, such as nails, or hitting potholes at speed, which can crush the tyre, causing a puncture. Airless tyres have been around for a while. You can get them from mini excavators, forklifts, military vehicles, and they even make them for bicycles now. But they have not been available for cars before, and unfortunately are not available yet. At the moment, the Aptus prototype is being put through its paces in a controlled environment, but will move into real-world testing in late 2019, with an expected availability to the public in 2024. The main benefits of these airless tyres are, they won't rupture or wear irregularly, they will never need to be inflated or the air pressure maintained, and you will never get a flat tyre. According to Michelin, around 200 million tyres are scrapped annually due to blowouts or irregular wear caused by drivers running on the wrong air pressures. Michelin says, by reducing the number of tyres that need to be scrapped, it can slash pollution and reduce the amount of raw materials required to construct new tyres. Now I think it's great we're moving towards a tyre that will prevent punctures, reduce pollution and resource usage, but how will police use spike strips to puncture the tyres on cars that are running from the police chasing them? You see police car chases all the time on TV and YouTube, and what usually brings down the fleeing car is either a pit manoeuvre, which is when a police car taps the corner of the fleeing car and makes it spin around, or spike strips which puncture the tyres and eventually brings the car down to its rims, which makes the car uncontrollable and eventually forces the car to stop or slide into a crash. Well I guess when you consider that more people in the environment will benefit from these tyres than the criminals taking advantage of them, I guess that will be a welcome change. Just means the police will need to come up with some new tactics. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.